that's it. Get the lights, Cosmos. Thanks, Cosmos. <laughs> I better hurry up and shut this off. Let that light cool. Hello, everyone. Doc here today. On this sh film short, Cosmos and I have decided to share with you over the past history of taking pictures. Look at this. In the old days, you would crank it up. You'd pull the trigger. And you'd get a few seconds of some really good footage that you liked, and you'd send it in, you'd wait a week, it'd come back, and then you'd need a projector like this to show it on. <laughs> wow, what a change, huh? And even bigger reels were needed in the olden days, even before this was put together. They come, made it smaller, you see, compact it. <laughs> so this is called Standard 8. This is a new improvement, making it easier to thread, because it's all automatic, where this isn't. And it's the high eight. Gives you all color. A lot better picture, as you see here. When I turn this machine on, it's quieter. Listen to this one. So it, not only is it quieter, but now you're getting a better picture. But still, you need a camera to get the shot with, develop it, let me turn it off here, and wait to see what you shot. In the next YouTube, we're going to talk a little bit more on how picture taking has evolved over the years. Cosmos, where's the twins? <laughs> I don't know about those guys. They were all dressed up. We were going to get their picture taken and look at them now. I can't win. Till next time, be safe out on the waters of the Northwest. Bye-bye. I want to get these shots of the twins all cleaned up.